it's quite obvious now that YouTube can control its content creators, so now they're harming basically a bunch of people, the YouTube heroes, in order to do their dirty job. Quite like a lynch mob, now the heroes have the power to report and even shut down some of the videos and consequentially the channels of many content creators. And if they do their filthy job well, YouTube will compensate them with quite useless rewards. It's like being in the Cold War all over again, there will be some hidden heroes that will report certain big YouTubers or maybe others that no one cares about. There will be spies, there will be hunts for witches those who managed to close some of the channels here on this website. But among the mist there will be some YouTube heroes that will reach the top and acquire full powers in order to fulfill their goals. And by their goals I mean the YouTube goals, since they are just tools in the YouTube administration hands. These superior class people are probably going to form a new kind of mafia in this website. They can easily threaten people, in order to not close this channel, maybe get paid to not report in them, or maybe they can even get paid by YouTube to close certain channels that are not very well seen by the administration. I foresee that this will be the most likely scenario to occur if the YouTube heroes all stuff will spread among users. So as some as the YouTubers on this website, as much as them also users and some of the fan base members want to have full power in order to do whatever they want. Especially haters are tired of only being able to comment and maybe dislike or report some videos in order to uh, make them hear their voices, so now they want some more weapons to spread their message of hate and uh, generally not liking uh, the other person that don't think as themselves. And YouTube knows that really really well and I think that was the point of this, especially for the fact that uh, the whole YouTube heroes thing was so hated by the most part of the internet, probably they will focus more, much more on the people that actually uh, accepted this and uh, wanted this sort of gift and maybe they will be the ones that will have so much control on this stuff. Of course it will be quite hard to attack bigger channels like PewDiePie or Markiplier, channels that have more than 1, 2, 5 million subscribers. In that case there could be quite the opposite situation. In that case there would be the fanbase threatening the YouTube heroes in order to not report their channel or else only such people that want so much power won't realize that they have already in their hands what they need in order to fulfill their goals, such as disliking, reporting, and generally the most powerful weapon is not viewing the content of someone you don't like. Negative reports are quite like as positive reports, they do quite the same, they spread the same amount of fame uh, relatively to that person, but of course uh, hating is much more fun than simply do not doing anything. In conclusion, will you be one of those who want uh, Will Down to become a part of the private militia secret police of YouTube? Or will you be one of their loyal hounds? Will you either become a YouTube hero or live long enough to see yourself become the villain? I can only say one thing. Baciamo le mani. Good night and good luck.